लाइन इतना मत उठाओ आगे बैठ के capture the heart passion and drive behind these inspiring individuals whose dare to do spirit makes them nothing short of legendary business icons film stars sports heroes political leaders artists chefs spiritual and wellness gurus society achievers has them all and so we excited to have you all here as we unveil the latest issue here today without further ado can i call the legendary man himself mr nari hira on stage with a huge round of applause please the one and only nari hira please join us hi sir good to always have you and always standing next to you is always a pleasure and mr ashok dimankar himself is already here director magnet publication The editor of Society Achievers, Andrea Costabay, big round of applause for her. And a very special guest this evening, the ever gorgeous. You know who that is? <laughs> Manisha Koirala, big, big, big round of applause for her. Welcome, Manisha. Thank you so much. Her name is synonymous with grace, talent, and resilience. With a career spanning over three decades, she has captivated audiences with her remarkable performance in films like Bombay, Will Say, 1942: A Love Story, Kamoshi, Agni Sakshi, Indian, to name but a few. Most recently, she dazzled, dazzled us with a stellar performance as Malika Jain in the Netflix series Dira Mandi. <laughs> oh, wish. I played a small role also. She couldn't even recognize me inside, but I had to tell her this is this was me wearing specs and a hat and that. Her acting prowess has rightfully earned her numerous accolades, including several awards for Best Actress. A big round of applause for her once again. Thank you for gracing us today, Anisha. A powerhouse in every sense, she has shown immense strength and determination through personal struggles and reclaimed her place. her place in the spotlight manisha's journey is a testament to her spirit and a commitment to her craft she continues to be a role model for many proving that with resilience and passion anything is possible please put your hands together for her resilience and veera mandi has <laughs> which we all loved okay uh a small uh, felicitation for manisha for mr narahira okay first we'll unveil the magazine first and then we'll do all that okay so we go on the side we we'll, the latest issue where manisha is on the cover of the magazine so let's unveil it narahira sir andrea manisha ashok ji where is the cover Rising high, Manisha Kurala. Fantastic. So can we felicitate Manisha now, please, with a beautiful bouquet? Ha. <laughs> There we have two Manishas. I don't know how many Manishas here, in fact. But the main thing is she's live here herself. in flesh and bones and looking ever so gorgeous the flowers are adding on so beautifully to her demeanor and a felicitation of the legendary mr nari hira himself today manisha would Yes, please. Nari sir, a big round of applause for Nari sir. Right. The one and only Nari Hira.
We can do better, guys. Energy is coming from our hands. It's also growing. The first thing is that 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 featured Sachin uh, in society this month, in Society Achievers. So, uh, Mr. Hira and uh, Manisha and Ashok will now felicitate Sachin. Thank you so much. <laughs> Let me get back to my hosting. Okay, can we call upon the Magnet team on stage, please? Shivendra Ji, Shivendra Parihan, Sunil, please aye stage pe aye. Pita Nair, Amber Das, can we have you on stage, please, with a special photo of this is the team behind all the society magazine events. They work really hard behind stage. You never get to know what they do, but it's, it's their day and night effort which makes all these events possible. Thank you, Team Magnet. You guys are invincible, in invincible tonight. All right, Manisha, I'll ask you a few questions today. But I'm sure everybody's dying to know more about your journey, what is happening now, and the success, the success of Vira Mandi. The glow has come back ten folds again, and, and it's it's beautiful. Your performance, I loved it. In fact, especially the reef scenes when she was high and dancing. All those scenes just give me goosebumps. Really. Okay, for, how does it feel to be a part of the Society Achievers magazine cover? Thank you, Sachin, for a lovely introduction. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, sir. Uh, it's such a pleasure to be here. Uh, before I begin, I must tell everybody, I have a long association with Magna Publication and Nayabi Hira, sir, and, um, and Ashokji. So it's been... Thank you for putting me up in the cover of Society Achievers cover. It's a huge, huge uh, honor uh, because uh, they're very particular about whom they choose. And they didn't put me on a cover before. <laughs> and they put, uh, put me on a right time when it was well deserved, right? <laughs> so it, it's, it speaks uh, a lot about their choosiness and their authenticity of you know so thank you uh, I would consider this is as a part of a labor of love for me because I put in my heart and soul for Hira Mandi and in return I received so much of love and blessings from everyone and this is one of the blessings I received so thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, some more questions about Hira Mandi. As we all know, the season two is coming now and we're very, very happy and excited to watch season two. I think it's gonna be, I think a year maybe from now onwards, uh, hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, that we will see you again and season two. Okay, first, how is it like stepping into the role and uh, what do you want to explore in season two now? There's so much that you've explored in season one. We don't know uh, in a season two when it's going to happen. Okay. So can't speak about that. But let me speak about season one. I mean, sure. what we did. So it's phenomenal to work with Sanjay Leela Bansali, as I have said it before. And everybody who's worked with him has said it before. 
uh, he's a master of his craft and uh, the level of um, passion and commitment he has it only inspires everybody around him and for me it was so timely because I'm also uh, I would say after doing 100 films, after after being part of a beautiful film industry which has welcomed me with open arms and given me uh, space to shine and given me identity uh, in the world as an Indian film actor coming from Nepal. So I, I'm hugely grateful for it. I'm hugely, hugely grateful for it. And so for me it was really timely because you know, I've reached a stage where I feel if the project really drives something, passion and commitment or demands that from me, then I'll be part of it. I was happily gardening in Nepal, <laughs> you know, in my small little garden and all that. And when this came, I jumped and, you know, it's been such a beautiful experience working uh, with Sanjali Lavansali and humongously talented co-stars. And by the way, uh, I told you upstairs also, when I did the scene with him, though I did not recognize Sachin, I must say that, because when we worked, he was in a get-up. He had glasses, he had topi, and you know. Yeah. But I was already briefed by Sanjay, saying that, Manisha, be on your toes. You're going to be working with really serious performers. Uh, you know, you. Th there you go. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, thank you. Yeah, I mean, I think uh, all my co-stars in Hira Mandi were fabulously talented and hardworking. And uh, I feel it's a Hira Mandi family. More than anything else, there's so much of love, so much of hard work, so much of affection. Of course, there's, you know, when a big, huge team comes along, there is ups and downs. That's part of the life, I, you know. But then there's so much of love and affection and we all wanted to shine in that project. So, and we were given given that platform. Yes. So, yeah. With a singular goal to make Hira Mandi the best thing possible ever. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yes. Great, great. I'm glad you were a part of it. I think nobody else could have played that role except for you the way you did it. Yes. Absolutely. Thank you, thank you, thank some, you. You know, some roles are meant for some people. Like, I cannot see anybody else except for Manisha doing that role now, the way I saw her. Would you guys agree on that? I think people will agree completely in, you thank know. Thank you, thank you guys. <laughs> and also Manisha, you've been a huge advocate of women's health. You know, always been talking about women's health. What do you think are the three most important things that women should do, you know, or make them a part of your life, their lifestyle? Uh, what would you advocate there? So what I've always seen, I've seen it in my family, I've seen growing up, I've seen around, you know, that women normally are excellent caregivers because uh, whether it's a mother, whether it's a wife or somebody, whenever it's, um, somebody falls sick, it's the women who actually look after the person who's fallen. And I really want to talk to the women that first you need to focus on your own health, on your own well-being, be responsible towards your health and take ownership of your health. And uh, yes, uh, you must look after uh, people that you love. You must look after your, you know, people around you and everything. But don't forget yourself in the bargain, you know. And uh, prioritize your health because, you know, health hai to sab kuch hai. Health nahi hai to, you know, ham log kuch bhi enjoy nahi kar sakte hai. Kuch bhi jitna bhi paisa ho, jitna bhi fame ho, jitna bhi sab kuch ho. But if you don't have health, we really can't enjoy this life. So prioritize your health. And in that, I think uh, the three things which come to my mind immediately is body, mind, spirit, you know? Because body, mind, spirit is interconnected, intertwined and dependable. The very, like how is your mood? If you're depressed, if you're sad, it's gonna reflect on your body as well. So just keep that in mind that our, my, my mood is not detached to my body. So to keep a healthy body, the mood also should be happy and in a good space. So should be your mind, so should be your spirit. You know, whichever path you believe, or you're a non-believer, doesn't matter. But you know, even a non-believer uh, believer believes in the nature. So something you cling on to larger than yourself. 
and uh, enjoy this life, enjoy this health, enjoy this beautiful opportunity that we have uh, being alive in this planet. True, true. We are part of nature. That's the only blessing we have. Let's not spoil it. Let's maintain it. Let's grow with it. Be connected to it, right? Yeah. Fantastic. Oh, to Manisha, there's so many, you've been a part of so many films, such beautiful roles you've done, which have been, you know, etched on in our lives forever. Uh, what do you, what would you advise youngsters who would want to be a part of this industry, you know? So, I always say this, um, don't go for the fluff. Go for, if you really, really, really passionately love acting, love cinema, love any technical aspect of it just go for it then no matter whatever hurdles you're facing you will sail through it you will put in the hard work you will put in the hours and you will still be joyful because this is what you love to do but if you are going for the fluff that means you're constantly your focus is not on what you're doing you're you're always focused about oh the glamour oh the money Oh, this. So, uh, if you're going for the fluff, you're going in for the wrong reason. That will become your byproduct of the passion and the love that you have for your profession that you choose. So, choose wisely. Absolutely, absolutely. Very well said. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Manisha. A big round of applause for her once again. Thank you. you know? Thank you for the love. Thank you so much. <laughs> Okay, before we wrap up the evening, we would like to take a moment to facilitate some achievers from various fields. They have been a big help to society during the pandemic itself. Hence, we would like to honor them. Who better than Manisha to do honor them herself? Okay, can I request uh, Dhanesh Chedaji to please come on stage? The well known entrepreneur, designer Mumbai's high end fashion store, Just Man, who's been featured in the issue as well. Dhani Shedha, big round of applause for him. There he is, looking dapper. Thank you, Danish. <laughs> Thanks, Ashok, for this wonderful, wonderful gesture. I'm not supposed to be here for this people around Manisha, Sachin, Ashok, Mr. Hira. Thank you for all the love here. Thank you very much. It's our pleasure. Pleasure to have you here. Dr. Umesh Mittal, Director of Mittal Medical Center, Delhi. He takes a holistic approach to well-being and one of the most laws for him. He... Thank you, sir, for being a part of this lovely evening. Applause for Dr. Mesh Mittal. Could you like to say this? Yes, please. Thank you so much for every, uh, to everybody, especially my uh, uh, drug company, for inviting me here for this evening. And especially Mr. Hira, I talked to him privately. He's 86 and maintaining good health. And I asked him to give me some <coughs> carry on message. To be a celebrity and in good health like him. <laughs> he told me one very nice thing. Be nice to the world, world will be nice to you. Thank you, sir. It is an eye, this was an eye opener to me. Thank you so much. You. Very well said, sir. Absolutely. It's all karma. Be nice to people, we will be nice to you. Otherwise, <laughs> Dr. Soesha Khaneja, there she is looking beautiful, gorgeous, a leading IVF specialist, medic gynecologist, and a gynecologist based in New Delhi. There she is. A small token of appreciation for your work, for society, for what you do. Congratulations and thank you for being a part of this evening today. Pleasure. Can you to say a few words? Thank you so much. It's really, I'm feeling very humble and obliged to be here and receiving the award from you. 
So when you get recognized for your work, you really get motivated to do it. I mean, we do it in a better way, but definitely it feels really nice when you get appreciated for it. Thank you so much. Thanks. Gynecologist with a special interest in assisted reproductive technology. Big round of applause for Dr. Neeti Vijay. I think it's it's a great, you know, it, it's a very powerful job to assist someone in reproduction, you know, get a child in this world to assist someone on that. It's just beautiful. Thank you so much for this award and appreciation coming from the hands of such great personalities. And it's always an honor to be respected and to be awarded for your hard work. And thank you, Mayor, for inviting us. Thank you so much. Dr. Rajesh Rajora, consultant physician at Asta Hospital, Ghaziabad. Dr. Rajesh Rajora, there he is. Say a few words, Dr. Rajesh. Thank you, Mayor. I'm surprising. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Keep up the good work, Dr. Sahab. Thank you so much for being here tonight. Dr. Kundan, and the director of the Abati Clinic Center for Assisted Reproduction and Endoscopy in Pune. There he is. Welcome, Dr. Saab. Congratulations. Keep up the good work. Uh, I think uh, speaking in front of her, who is a leader in the acting, I think, and uh, it's, it's lovely to receive an award from uh, at her hand. So uh, we work in a women's sector, I think. One of the very important areas where a woman needs uh, help is the reproduction. And it's a really pleasure to work in that area and take care of her in that important time period. So I think, uh, as you said, uh, she has to take care of her health. And that's our always the motivation. So thank you very much for that appreciation. I think appreciation is something which everybody loves. And at your hands, I think that's the greatest thing which I have with you today. Thank you so much. Thank you. A photo takes it. Very humble, he wants to present a book. Sir. Styling at the top, the journey of Shiva. Fantastic. I think all of us want a book to happen in our names, hopefully. He's as humble as can someone be and an amazing guy. Shiva sir, where are you going? Amazing, amazing man. He loves. And he's present, presenting a beautiful painting to Manisha Ji. Dr. Neil Muraka, lovely. A big round of applause for him, please. Now I want to call upon someone uh, we all know. Okay, one more picture, a nice one. Muraki, you smile to Vijay, you can see it. Anil sir, you can tell me something about the song. It's a pleasure being here. I saw them on the screen. I'm watching today's practical. It's something Unbelievable, you have been an idol. People watch over you. The way you have taken up things, the way you have come out of certain things in life. A journey to, to be cherished and to follow. That's what all you are about. Thank you so much. Thank you. Lovely to have you here always from our side. Would like to say a few words? Okay, thank you so much. A good
Hello. It's really an honor to be here and I'm very happy that, you know, we will, at Mayor, we work a lot on women healthcare. We are one of the leading nutraceutical companies uh, in the world and we tr try, we harness that to make this world a better place to live. And nothing can be more thrilling than receiving this appreciation from you. Thank you. Thank you, madam. Thank you, Ashokji. It's our pleasure, sir. Yes. Chanda, please join us on stage. Welcome, Chanda. Come for a small photo up, please. on stage please the Dubai based educationist and yoga expert I really want her to be on stage professional lawyer and uh, I come very often on Republic TV times now and I'm pretty much a media man in a way but uh, the other thing that I do is something which was found out founded by Tata's Bajaj Godraj and Birla's it's Council for Fair Business Practices so I'm the president of that and my predecessors have been Tata's Bajaj and Godraj and I appreciate this opportunity that Society Magazine is giving to me especially Mr. Narihira and who better than to stand next to when it comes to, uh, you know, I think it was Manisha's possibly by far the best performance that I have seen. I think she really animated the stage. It was initially my wife told me that it was a tough choice between Sonakshi and uh, uh, Manisha's acting. But I think there is no question, you know, that's her opinion. But I completely, I often tend to argue with my wife. She's also a lawyer, by the way. So this is one of the arguments which I eventually succeed. Yeah, it's, it's a very hard job, let me tell you that. And uh, thank you very much, Manisha. Fabulous acting. Great opportunity standing next to you. And thank you very much, Mr. Narihira. And thank you very much, uh, Mr. Kur Sachin uh, Kurana. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, sir. I think it's an opportunity to stand next to Manisha, ma'am. Mm. I mean, I've been a great, great, I would say a small little lover uh, for your acting starting from uh, Bombay. Uh, I mean, they'll say, and you know, I've been a great, I've also spoken to you. And her acting in Hiramandi was fabulous. Loved it, loved it. I mean, talking about me, and also we connected on the lines of wellness. So I'm a laughter yoga, internationally certified laughter yoga expert. I also do corporate trainings and seminars. I make, although I would say I make people laugh. So, because I think today's world people have forgotten how to laugh. So that's what I do. I initiate, I try and make people laugh. It's a technique, of course, but, uh, and it's very important as ma'am has already mentioned. Just try one session, yeah. <laughs> okay, you wanna, you wanna try? Okay, let's do that. Okay, all you have to do is just laugh, right? So let's laugh together. So first I will show you how to laugh and then everybody just follows after me. Yeah, there we go. One. Two and three. In fact, I tell everybody put laughter in your life, you will keep the doctors away. Because Are we sure we want that? In fact, it's a very contradicting scenario happening. So daughters also want that in a way. No, because I think we all are so much in, Is this our, the problem in our work, our responsibility, right? And that's what we don't take care of. Ma'am already mentioned. So learn to take care of yourself. So if you spend that five minutes laughing, self-laughing in front of the mirror, I mean, you will avoid doctors as much as possible. And wherever needed, you will utilize them in a better way. So thank you very much. Yes, self laughing first. Yes. You, Fantastic. In fact, you can start, stand in front of the mirror and just laugh. Try that, and you will see a difference. For how much? For five minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes. We already have a followers to do that. Anybody else to do that from tomorrow onwards? I will going to do that. So, see, superb, superb. Abhi, aaj bolo bolo kal karoge. Aaj hi bolo to matlab kal to bol jao, fir kuch nahi hone wala. But the daughters are there, you have to take the number of them. Thank you so much, thank you so much Manisha for being part of a lovely evening. Thank you so much everyone for being a part of this lovely evening, all the guests, everyone.
Okay. It has been a super special, small, cozy evening for all of us. Thank you so much. Ha. I just uh, want to uh, say thank you, Madam Publication. Thank you, Nari Rasa. You know, over the years, the kind of affection, love, and dedicated work that you have shown. And you're a legendary figure. You're a legendary figure. And to receive uh, this sort of affection is a humongously, humong uh, huge thing for me. So thank you for your love and blessing. And uh, I really need to know at 87, 88, how do you keep up the great health, sir? I need to follow your footpath. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I really need to know. You know, isn't it? So one round of applause for him. His life has been dedicated towards, you know, a great media and great uh, this thing. So thank you, sir for making me part of this and uh, putting me in a cover. Thank you. Thank you, Ashok, so much for this. Thank you so much, everyone. Have a good evening. So once you're in Mumla profession, you are following your dream automatically on a right track. But of course, you know, your job will give you a lot of challenges or the new city will give you challenges. There's so many challenges we all face, right? But if you have uh, self-belief and you keep your focus on your goal, automatically things will happen you know I mean, it's it just that you it's a baby step yes uh, walking towards your dream yes, walking achieving you know all yes, that not don't jump too much yes, you know you put in your hard work yes, put in your uh, hours and efforts exactly. and just keep you know you keep your soul happy keep exactly. your, yourself happy focus on that as well. thank you beauty lies in the eyes of beholders they came I believe in that. Wonderful experience. Over the years, it's always been kind, as Nadira sir said, be nice to the world and the world will be nice. I believe in that too. Thank you. Thank you, boys. Thank you, guys.